Hello, my Leo, Sagittarius and Aries. I'm supposed to be a blessing. If you're new to my channel, please take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. With that being said, we're going to get right into your reading today. It's December the 5th, 2020. Let's see what's going on for you guys. Okay, um, yeah, you've been working extremely hard is what I'm saying. Your intuition is very high because the high priestess is showing up. When she shows up in your reading, tells me that your third eye is on and popping. So you're seeing some things for what they truly is. And this is making you extremely happy. Some of you could be dealing with Leos here. You do have a water sign, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces individual coming in to make you an offer here in regard to something. All right, the number three could signify something as well as I think I see a letter B as well. So that could mean something significant to you guys. I also see here plenty of offers that's going to be offered to you. So you're going to have to use your intuition in regard to that to choose the correct ones. Because just because something looks good for you does not mean that it is good for you. Okay, okay, for 19 increases on the horizon. Um, you completed one cycle, you're going to another. There's going to be some more seeds that you're definitely going to be planting. You're writing your visions. You're making it plain. Defending yourself against others. Standing up for yourself at all costs. Cursing motherfuckers out. Back and forth. Doing what you got to do. That's why sometimes you got to get people up off of you. You know what I'm saying? Because they be coming trying to talk out of the side of their neck and shit. You want to karate chop their ass. Anyway, um, you have the lover's card, which is Gemini card. You could be dealing with that. But there's definitely love in your mind. I do see new love should be coming in for you guys. Y'all have banged been fo focusing on your finances. But there's a section of y'all who definitely want love. Because Leos are the heart of the Zodiac. Not just Leos, but Leos are the heart of the Zodiac. But fire signs, you're very passionate. So you need that kind of connection, you know, to be with somebody. Not saying that you can't be by yourself. Because there's plenty of Leos who are by themselves. Why am I keep saying Leo? So Leo's must be definitely significant for you guys. But um, let me get back to y'all ring because I go on a whole different rampage about something else. You have a lot of things on your mind, fire sign, Leo, Sag, and Aries. You're going to get the clarity and truth that you need in regard to something. Yep, definitely isolating yourself to come up with the answers that you need. And all you got to do is trust and believe in yourself. The answers are there. Um, mm, you could, That's an earth sign individual. Um, a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn individual who's definitely got their eye on you. And the full card is saying it's going to be a new beginning for you. Underneath the bottom of the deck, you have the Ace of Staff. So that's the creativity card. Your creativity is very high this time. You have the Cherry card, hitting things head on, moving on, keeping things moving. Somebody could be moving too, but the Star card is you're definitely shining bright. Things are going to balance out for you guys here, okay? Um... You're going to get the recognition that you just do here. This is what I'm seeing. I'm like, you guys, I'm loving this thing. Loving it, loving it, loving it. And then you have your ships coming in on the horizon. Anyway, hello, one more. This one more, this one more. Hey, y'all got the Ace of Cups. So this is new love. Doors of an opportunity open up for you guys. All right, and look how pretty this is. Oh, the initial m is here so that could mean something to somebody look how pretty that is y'all anyway um please take a moment to like subscribe and comment remember i'm supposed to be a blessing and y'all have a truly blessed day thank you